Hello everyone, it's Aunt Fernita. Today's story is called Too Precious to Lose. The memory verse is from Luke chapter 19, verse 10. It says, For the Son of Man came to seek and to save what was lost. The message is Jesus looks for me because I am precious to him. Kristen's best friend, Kaylin, gave her a special book for her birthday. One day, Kristen lost the book. She looked all over for it. In our story today, Jesus tells about a woman who lost something important. Perhaps it happened like this. The morning sun warmed the back of the busy women. Laughter rippled through the crowd as they shared stories. Laundry day meant hard work, but happy visiting. As the women scrubbed and rinsed, they had something new to talk about. Have you heard the stories Jesus tells? asked one. They are so interesting, said another. He understands how we live. Back and forth they talked about seeing the sick people healed and about the kind things Jesus said. I hope to take the children to listen to him tomorrow, smiled a young mother. Oh, I would love to go along, agreed another. Soon, several of the women were making plans for the next day. Happy children skipped along beside their mothers the next day. Excitement was in the air. Soon, all the people sat down and Jesus began to speak. He told them a story about a shepherd losing one of his sheep and how happy the shepherd felt when he found it. Then Jesus began to tell a story that the little group of laundry ladies leaned forward in to hear. There once was a woman who had ten silver coins. One day, the woman lost one of her silver coins. Oh no! The woman thought about the poor woman in the story. That was about the most awful thing that could happen to a wife. What would her husband say? What would her neighbors and friends say? The lady lit a lamp and began to sweep her house, Jesus went on. She looked everywhere for her lost coin. Jesus watched the faces of the people listening to his story. He knew what their homes were like. Because they had small windows or no windows at all, it was dark inside, even in the daytime. It would be hard to find a coin. She kept searching. She would just not give up. On the table, under the table, behind the heavy water pot, she looked and looked. She searched the dirt floor. Suddenly she saw it. I found it, she cried, quickly picking up the smooth coin. Dashing outside, she ran to her neighbors and friends. Come, celebrate with me. I lost one of my coins, and now I found it. Many in the crowd laughed with relief. Jesus laughed with them. With a twinkle in his eye, he added, There is rejoicing in the presence of angels of God over one sinner who repents. This podcast is read by Franita Buddy for gracelink.net. Created and produced by Falvo Fowler. Post produced by Faith Toe at Studio El Piso. The theme music is by Clayton Kinney. Animation and artwork by Giogo Godoy. The audio engineer was Karel Holness. For more information, please visit gracelink.net.